Hello everyone, I'd like to share with you a few trades that were posted on Wednesday, 20th of September 2023. These trades were shared by AA, who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see, the macro chart is in downtrend and is gaining momentum. And you can see the same downtrend channel in the structural chart. So using a smaller trading time frame, he identified two area of pullbacks and entered here based on algo one to five and set up T and manage and close them with exit strategy number one with profit. So thank you AA for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by MG who's trading Dow Jones CFD. As you see the macro chart is in downtrend and it passed the point of control and we can see the downtrend channel in the structural chart clearly. So using a smaller 10 second trading time frame, he identified multiple areas of sell short entries and entered them and managed and closed them with exit strategy number one with profit. So thank you MG for sharing your trades with us. The next trades were shared by Castro, our global instructor, who is trading Nasdaq CFD. As you see, the price reached an area of static resistance and it got rejected. So for the second time when the price retested this level and got rejected, he entered two positions here with setup C and managed and closed this also with very good risk to reward and profit. So thank you Castro for sharing your trades with us. The next few trades are those that I have taken during the New York market session and the video with detailed explanation was sent to students yesterday. So I'm going to replay the video here for you. Hello everyone. I like to share with you the trade that I have taken today on Wednesday, 20th of September 2023. These trades were taken on NASDAQ, Dow Jones, and S&P 500 futures. If we look at the one hour macro chart, we see that the price during the global session was fluctuating around the previous day close and it started to go up during the London session and again went down after nine o'clock when the New York market session opened. It was more downtrend on the NASDAQ. So around 940, the price tested the previous day close and got rejected and bounced temporarily. So I took several long positions on NASDAQ and at the same time on YM, I took several long positions, mostly with setup B and one more time around 1040, the price bounced again above the previous day close on S&P 500. So I took one long position also here. So these signals from these charts were copied by copy trader to multiple Apex Trader funds accounts. And as you see, the result was positive, showing the profit factor of 1.53 with about 67% win rate and average win to loss ratio of 0.77. The largest winning trade was 420 and the largest losing trade was $369. So hope this trade taken by the path system is useful for you. And let us know if you have any questions. Have a wonderful day.